Welcome back. Now, I am so excited because I do actually understand that uh, you are, in fact, uh, being uh, working with the Citizens for Disabilities Ontario to develop a forum for engaging youth with disabilities. Could you tell us about that? Oh, actually, that that was some time ago. It was in Ottawa. I don't know what, what they're doing these days, but that was quite a good experience when that happened. It was a few years ago now, but yeah, so isn't with this one in Ontario is a great organization. It's a provincial organization that advocates for, for people with disabilities on a variety of issues. Um, their website is cwdo.org if you want to check it out. Excellent. And in terms of your area of expertise and what you are working on, could you tell us what is in store coming up? Well, the next Toronto Disability Pride March will be coming up on September 18th, um, 2021. We're not sure yet at this time whether it'll be an in-person march or a virtual march because of everything going on in the world with the pandemic right now. Um, but either way, I'm sure it'll be an excellent time. Um, there'll be more information to come soon. If, you, if you'd like to find out more information coming up, it'll be on tdpm.org. Um, you can also find us on all the big social media websites like Twitter and um, Facebook and all that. Excellent. Now, yeah. Sorry, Julia, you were saying? Melissa, I would love to follow your journey and keep in touch. How can we follow you and keep up with what you're doing? Well, you can find me on, on Facebook or Twitter or Instagram. Um, my Twitter handle is Melgram at, Mel, at Melgram and I actually can't think of my Instagram handle. I should know that off the top of my head. But I am on Instagram, so you can look at me there as well. Um, I'm also pretty active in the community and easy to find in, here in Toronto. Absolutely. I will attest to that. I was able to find her really easily because when you um, are looking up advocates, movers and shakers in the disability world, she pops right up. And I'm just so delighted that you are here on our platform, being able to impart your wisdom, your passion and your message. It is such an honor to be with somebody who is such a, an incredible source of strength and wisdom for so many. And on that note, I wanted to see if you had any um, advice for people watching right now. What would you tell them? I think I would tell you if you have something that you're passionate about or even something that's just really bothering you to speak out about it and, and get your voice out there because you never know who else might be thinking the same thing and want to join up with you and sort of create something out of that experience. So so don't be afraid to get out there and be heard about things that are important to you. I think is the most important message I can give for today. That is incredible and definitely let that percolate uh, just to know that you too like melissa can make your voice heard and make a true difference we are going to let that wisdom percolate as we cut to commercial break and for those of you who want to connect with melissa please do check our website as all of her contact information is there thank you yeah.